Hey guys, look at my 245 and I'm here with another LEGO review and the continuation of the Holly 2018 series. So let's get on with the video. <clears throat> so here we have the Desert Skiff Escape. This is set number 75174. This comes with 277 pieces, comes with four minifigures, and retail for 30 bucks in the States and came out in the 2017 spring wave. Pretty sure the spring wave. Anyway, let's get on the minifigures. First up we have Han Solo. This version is the one that appeared in, this is all Return of the Jedi minifigures. This is the minifigure that occurred after right before and no, I mean after yeah after. After the carbon freezing chamber. So he has the same I'm pretty sure he has the same shirt that he has that he had and it dropped over this guy. He has the same shirt that he actually did use in the other set. He used, I'm pretty sure he used the same shirt in the pants in the other set. He now has the same new hair piece. Sorry. As, if I can grab it. There you go. The same new hair piece as the Han Solo. The new Han Solo hair piece that originated in the Death Star set. So that's nice. He has two expressions, I'm pretty sure. One the worried, and the other one, I'm pretty sure, is carbon freezing. And, yep, I'm right. Carbon freezing. I think it's the... I think every single aspect of this minifigure is the same one that I reviewed earlier this year. In the... In the, car, in the carbon freezing chamber set. Sorry, I'm just putting back the Han Solo minifigure. And, okay. Now back to the video. Rev. Just the hair piece is different. So that's nice. Next up we have Chewbacca. And he's also wearing handcuffs. With Chewbacca, he has this... I like the new mold. It has this new mold. With this with a custom mold that actually has some more detail with the, with the hair. Which I like. It's interesting. It's the same one that we've got in pre previous sets. Like the Falcon. The Death Star. I don't know what other ones they were. Sorry. I'm s Yeah. I'm trying to think. He also has handcuffs on before he's being gonna be dropped in the star like pit. But yeah, I've seen him all a few times when I dragged the way. He has the detail on the hair, so that's nice. This is Boba Fett and he has his new mold that ended up coming in. He has his his head his helmet mold. He has his it's all nice. He has his blaster. He has his Mandalorian armor with all his patches and designs. He has his little thing in the back and his little antenna there. And he also has his famous rocket ship pack. He also has his custom blaster as well. And right over here we have the weak. We have the weak way. We have the weak way skiff guard. Sorry, I need to this guy up. This, I mean, I like the minifigure. It is interesting. He has, a little, he has does have bushy eyebrows, or either that or it's nope. He doesn't. He just has some things. Like, I don't know. He's an alien. He has some. Uh, he's kind of orange, just tan, brown, with some tan. He also has a weapon of an axe, so it's kind of nice. He has some things in the back, so that's nice. I can really explain these things really well. <clears throat> Let's get on to the Sarlacc pit. Pretty sure this is the. Maybe possible. This is possibly the third adaptation of the Desert Skiff. Tell me in the comments if I'm wrong, and, tell, and if I'm right, then whatever. But if you don't, tell me in the comments, and also tell me what one it is. So this is a nice thing. It's all tan. It has some these teeth in there. It has some snakes. That's some of these small things, but you mainly control with this one. You can lift it up. You can move it here, that way, that way. So it's kind of nice. It's all free range, and every single one of these things can move. That's also nice. <clears throat> now let's get on with the Desert Skiff. This is a nice set. I like it. It's then it's I it's I feel I think it's nice. It's all it is all smooth and down, so it's a nice slow feature that does have. Sorry, I'm trying to reorganize these things in the bottom. Okay. Yeah, it's it's nice. I like it. It's very smooth. It's brown, tans. 
I mean, it does have this blocky thing in the back. It has these two things in the back. I think that's why it's called a skiff. I don't, I don't even know exactly what a skiff really is. So I'm assuming this is it. Someone comments exactly what it is. If you do, no, actually. I mean, there's this little thing in the back where you can just push this out. <laughs> like if I do this in the back, you can see how you do it. You just push it out there. Like the the Destiny Shadow that I reviewed earlier this month. So you can just put them out there and just put them to the Sarlacc. That's kind of nice. So it's nice. There are some control panels over here. Not really much here, but over here you can end up lifting this. You can lift, lift this off and reveal a little mini blaster. A secret hidden blaster in the compartment there. It's a nice little blaster. I like it. That's pretty much just said. I'm sorry I would. I was going to go with Jurassic the Jurassic World and the, and the city thing, but I decided instead I would just do the star, do some of the Star Wars stuff. I didn't get to do, didn't get the chance to actually do this stuff, so I decided I might as well just do this. So I hope you liked this video. Please comment, like, share, and subscribe for more, and I'll see. Still in the comments what you want to see in 2019. See you guys next time. Bye.